Hello, I'm Alex. Uh, this is the first video of this sort that I've done, so I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, it might not be great, but that's alright. Uh, this is about how to disagree. Um, disagreeing is pretty easy. People do it every day. One way to disagree that is very straightforward is to just say, I don't agree with that. Uh, sometimes it's even better if you point out, you said, hey, you said this, I don't agree with that. And then you can proceed to share what you, why you don't agree. It seems pretty straightforward. If you think about it though, people don't always do that. Uh, one thing that I hear a lot is people saying, you're wrong. What's the difference between that? Uh, if I say, I disagree, I'm communicating how I feel. If I say, you're wrong, I'm sort of passing a kind of judgment on someone. I've noticed that telling someone that they're wrong tends to come across as more abrasive and more disrespectful than saying, I disagree. So I prefer to say, I disagree. Another thing that I hear people sometimes do, actually I don't hear it all that often, and I really like it when people do it, is if people say, I'm not sure if I agree with that. That's very different from saying, I disagree with that, because it communicates that the person is not quite sure how they feel. They maybe have a sense that they need to think a little bit more about whatever was said. I like that because it can slow down the conversation. So anyway, I hope this is able to give you a small insight that can hopefully improve, um, improve your ability to relate to people, and specifically improve your ability to talk to people that you may have differing views with. Uh, I think that if you express disagreement in straightforward ways, saying, I disagree, instead of saying, you're wrong, it can actually lead to much more fruitful dialogue. Uh, thank you, and goodbye.